Hello guys, Robomatrix presents to you something big today. We have always been working on so many sensors individually, but let us see what can happen if we compile a few sensors together. We tried developing a prototype design for a project, basically focusing in on the security of a premises. The vault, which is in the center, is protected by a three-layer security passage, which can be passed only by the correct pass keys known to the authorized person. In this video, we'll show you a walkthrough of the complete project. So let us directly jump to the first requirement to authorize this complete process, which is the fingerprint scanner. The fingerprint scanner as seen is placed outside the complete setup over here. The authorized person's fingerprint has already been fed into the microcontroller board used, which is an Arduino Mega. If the correct fingerprint is put on the scanner like this, the sensor will scan the fingerprint and then once checked up with the system, the green LED which is already glowing will turn off pointing the signal of authorization. Now if I use my other finger, the prints are not recognized. The LED will glow continuously, pointing out that the prints are not valid and a buzzer attached starts beeping. Now coming to the second level which is the hex keypad, attached just near the first door. The process remains the same. As soon as a correct passkey is entered, the servo motor that has been attached comes into action and the door opens. For the incorrect passkey, the process remains the same again and the door will remain shut. There is a timer attached with each and every door which closes the door after 5 seconds. Going through the passage, we get into the third level of security which is controlled using the Bluetooth sensor. The Bluetooth sensor HC05 is paired with the Bluetooth of any smartphone using the app Bluetooth Terminal. To pass through the third level, a particular key has to be entered into this app to authorize the access which ultimately opens the door. Going through the passage again, we reach the fourth and final level of security that is the RFID card reader. Now as we all know, all the RFID tags have a unique serial number with it. So this card has been scanned and paired with the system. As soon as I get the card near the receiver, the door opens. If the authorized card isn't present, the door remains shut. So this was all about the four types of sensors used for protection of the center vault. The project doesn't come to an end. There are four ultrasonic sensors attached, one on each wall of the vault. The function of these four ultrasonic sensors is, if at all, there is an intrusion detected inside the vault, Without the proper authentication of all the four sensors, the center part starts going down, trapping the person inside it just like this. If the person present has cleared all the four security levels, there would be no action and the floor will remain intact. So this was the complete project involving five different sensors in one project mainly concerning with the security of a premises. One or more than one sensors can be paired up together totally depending upon the need. Stay tuned for a range of exciting projects and working on various different sensors. Robomatrix.